taking over the world one nerd at a time. Total Nerd Takeover. Hello, Chris Gray here, and I've got a video review for you. Now, in my hot little hands is a box. Uh, well, it's an empty box because the actual stereo Bluetooth headphones I've been testing out and reviewing, and they're over here in my other hot little hand. So I want to give you some of the specs on the Senbowi um, Bluetooth stereo headphones. So I'm going to read on the back of the box and tell you what's inside. Now, for the specs for this pair of headphones, we have a standby time of about 220 hours. We have a talk time of about eight hours, and in my testing that I've, I've had these for about a month now, um, absolutely eight hours, uh, maybe a little bit more than eight hours, probably closer to nine hours, actually. And the charging time is about two hours. Um, two hours for a full charge with eight or nine hours of talk time, that's awesome. Now, the music time, according to uh, Sen Bowie, says 7.5 hours. This is inaccurate. I've gotten at least eight hours of music time with this pair of headphones. And it's I'm honestly kind of blown away considering how light and thin they are. This particular pair of Bluetooth headphones are um, their stereo and their Bluetooth version 4.1. The range is about uh, 30 feet, which is pretty accurate. Um, the only time I had a problem with these um, in terms of um, them disconnecting from my iPhone was when there was an object in the way, say like a car or a wall or a building or, or a van or whatever. That's the only time I had a problem. But for the most part, about 30 feet. They're light and I absolutely love them. And I like the fact that the wire's a little bit thicker. And you know, I've been wearing them and sometimes I forget that I have them on. And I definitely recommend them. Now right now on Amazon, they're on sale for $22. They were originally priced at $100. Now, $22 for a pair of stereo Bluetooth headphones that last you, say, eight hours of music time or talk time, and I don't think you can go wrong. All of the controls for this particular Bluetooth stereo headset are on the right side, on this right uh, control area here. And there's only three buttons. Three buttons take care of everything. They are also magnetically connected, and they fit in very nicely. There's kind of like a little Lego bump and they slide right inside um, the stereo headphones. So having only three buttons can be a little tricky. However, all the information is in the instruction manual when you wanna switch between your calls, if you wanna reject a call, mute a call, do three-way calling, it's all available in the instruction manual and it tells you which button press to use. Now they are voice enabled, so you will get voice prompts telling you when you're connected, when you're turned on, the battery level, and they can also be switched to Chinese or English. Pairing this stereo uh, Bluetooth headset is extremely simple. The first time you turn them on, all you have to do is press and hold the multifunction button for a few seconds uh, with an earbud in. It'll actually, a voice prompt will come on and say um, uh, you're, that you're turned on and that you're in pairing mode. Now you go to your smart device. Now if you're on an iPhone, it should show up as Z6000. Um, just tap on it and you will be connected and you'll get a voice prompt saying that you're connected. Now, if you're using an Android device, you may be asked for a prompt or maybe prompt to put in a password. And as always, the password is 0000. Now, in terms of audio quality, I absolutely love them. They are on par with the audio quality of my LG Tone 770 Pros. I love the bass, especially when you have the earbuds pressed all the way in, and they do a natural noise canceling when they're pressed all the way in, so just be careful when you're in, outside and you know riding a bike or whatever. Make sure you're paying attention to traffic. So before I let you go, I wanna give you an audio comparison for the microphone quality. That way, when you call somebody on the phone, you get an idea of what they're gonna hear. And I'm gonna compare them with the LG Tone 770 Pro to give you an idea of the audio quality you're gonna get. All right, so now you're hearing my audio as I'm coming through the microphone on the Sen Bowie Z6000. And as you can see, uh, not a terrible sound. This is what people are gonna hear when you call them or they call you on the phone. Now to give you that quick comparison, I'm gonna switch over to the LG Tone so you can get that, that comparison in audio quality. So now you're hearing my audio through the LG Tone 770 Pro. This way you can get an idea how they sound. Of course, you know, you're talking about a $50 pair of headphones, give or take, depending on where you get them, uh, to a $22 pair of headphones that are on sale. Um, absolutely recommend these 100%. And I'm going to switch back right now so we can go back to the audio here.
They sound great. The audio quality has been phenomenal. Uh, they're light. You hardly even notice that they're there. They're available in three different colors. You have the black, you have white, you have gold. I think uh, for $22, I don't, I don't think you can go wrong with these. Now, one thing I might have forgot to mention here is that when you use these, they do vibrate when you get a phone call. Or if you get some kind of notification, they will vibrate. And, of course, you get the voice prompt when you get a phone call. So I want to thank you so much for checking out this video. If you like this pair of Bluetooth stereo headphones, um, all I ask is that you check out my Amazon affiliate link in the description of this show. Uh, there's no extra charge to you, and you'll help to support me here at the studio so I can continue to make great videos. So thank you again, and I'll see you next time for another great video review.